Firo might have gone a bit earlier, Holosko. Instead, it's City who switched the point of attack. Crossfield instead. German slide is cast by eyes down to the technical area. Looks as though it might be a double change, in fact. Keep you posted on that. That's in tonight, the Sydney Football Stadium. It's uh, an enjoyable contest they're watching. German looking for the run of Grant, and he obliges. Be dissected perhaps more in the half time analysis. The boys back in the studio. Lovely ball that by Who are still recovering. Something was a great opportunity to launch a counter attack, but missing accuracy there, the Jets. Well played. Alberto injecting himself into the Wanderers attack and it very nearly found its way through for Pio Vaccari. It's a good ball by German. Oh, good first touch. Pio Vaccari inside the box. And that's a really good challenge by Matt German. Setter and German subsequently. And it's hooked away to safety by Brendan Hamill. But just for a moment it opened up there for Sydney FC. Now there's a bit of space on the right for Sepp. So many times I've seen that sort of situation where Referee immediately points at the privacy of the dressing room. He'll be savouring that. Arnie getting his. Arnie, Arnie was having a go at someone there. I think he might have been getting a bit from the crowd, but uh, there you go. To his right, Jamie Young. But you just see before that Corona slipping. A lot of the players slipping on a very slippery Allianz Stadium. Time. And then not on a wavelength with Matt Mackay, who was coming towards him. Tavares made a. Excellent start in the middle of the park. Talking points coming in tonight. Who's going to shade possession? Beautiful ball down the line from Stefan Uto to Jamie McLaren. And just tried to tease that one in for a team. Knee reconstruction, a serious ankle injury. To bring up 100 games tonight, Ryan Grant. Great effort from the kid. Yeoman. Goes back on his bike quickly. See if they can profit from it. Goes back going deep. Oh, it's off the frame of the goal. And Matt Yeoman hits. The early races in the Hyundai A League. Russia trying to weave his way through traffic. Yeoman. Goes back. Always looking to attack, isn't he? But he might have left Sydney a bit stretched here. Barisha's on his own. Fati in front of him, Yerman as well. He's around Fati. Still he goes on. And eventually, Ninkovic. Now Yerman. German able to carry the ball forward. Clip it forward. Very obviously get the feeling on how the game's going. and It's not been a free-flowing match. Those chances are so rare. Goes back. It'll break for Yerman. Good shape to the delivery. Sydney FC back into their own half. Right, run out of defence from German. Cross. That's a good header into space. Nearly broke for either Holosko or Brosk. Again, the fans are getting frustrated. Well, you want your midfield to play it, if at all possible, to face forward. Play forward. Dimitrievich and Tavares. Newcastle pretty happy at the moment. Most of it's in front of them. 
forward. Sydney FC recycling the ball through the centre halves. Yerman. Donovan pounced. German across. Left it in towards O'Donovan. Oh. Enough to bring it down for his central defensive partner. Dimitrievich has to go to the races and then go to the football and then watch the fireworks. Even though they're bottom of the table, six points adrift. Expect a decent crowd there. Room out here on the left hand side. Yerman gets it to him. Well, been getting overloaded. Well, the other uh, of the parks and they just swarm into little triangles. I'd love to have David Carney to swing this one in. Instead, it's a Levitich left with that duty. He scored in the win over Adelaide United in last year's finals to put them into the grand final. Here's a loss. Now Kitto trying to get around Yerman who shielded it. Oh, yeah. Good strong challenge from Yerman. It's been a few. The little situations and moments with Newcastle, it's been more promising. German drops it over the top of Calvin. And his hunger too good. Here's Nichols, who's got front position on Tavares, trying to square it up for Castellan. Here goes Scott Neville. Trying to slip it through for Castellan, who's quick, but he's not going to get there. Lucas to drive towards goal. Vinicic cleverly lets it run for Neville, and then goes for the return. Beautifully worked by the Wanderers. Bridge waited to pull the trigger before Sydney got it. He'll miss the Wanderers next game in Gosford, away to the Central Coast Mariners. Sydney FC, meantime, got visions of stealing this derby right at the death. Good shake to the delivery, and it'll drop here for Shane Smeltz, who could... Fans make of that. It's a clever ball by Georgievski. And they look to... Squares it up for Ninkovic. And now Yerman. Lovely ball. Lovely ball from Matt Yerman. Ryan Grant away. Chance for Sydney. Unbeatable one-on-one. -on -one. Sydney FC. It's what... They managed to achieve against the Wanderers in winning... Broxham. Barbarossas has got away from perhaps a tiring Ryan Grant. And there's Yerman again. Plays in the air as well. Barisha's good in the air. Ansel and Del Pierre too. Well now, Vukovic had a long... And it's not... He just feels that for his development, he's not ready to go. Anyway. Space down this left-hand side. German again goes straight. And they were on their way. Pass to find Enrique from Tetrados was. Will it hold up enough for Lustica? Yes, it will. Kamau again. You say yes, getting forward. Too far out right in front of Thierry. Uh, it's a shame. Good situation developing for them. And Yerman striding out. Still Matt Yerman clipped by Pablo Sanchez. At half time between these two. It was the finals of season one at this venue. Walk. Great ball. Terrific ball out to Pablo Sanchez. Across the ground. Looking for see a team that's desperate to win this game. Really need to capitalise on it. German. That's a great little ball in. Cross clever. 
Tumba was there to clean it up. Vodic, tired looking Christian Vodic has given it up. That's a great ball in. Now Carney. Of course, a huge talking point. But where do the goals come from for Sydney FC? Despite a lot of the commentary of Sydney, but they just can't keep the ball and stem the flow. It's been Matt Yerman again, Sebastian Rock. Vinicic. Good stretch by Yerman. And his intelligent running has been a feature of this game. Castellan. Wide to right is Nichols. Goes first time. Right on. See what Carney can conjure up here. It's flicked dangerously across the face. And it pops for Yerman. It's like pinball. Uh, the red card of Jack Fatih. Can they hold on, Sydney? Here's Georgievski. Thompson waiting. It's Daniel Georgievski. Oh. And Matt Yerman again stuck out a long right leg. Nice accuracy in that pass. Playing for the free kick and not getting it. And now Navio deals wide. Newman had to give up the chase in forte for John Van Skip, if I can put it that way. You know, and there's some mitigating circumstances. That have forward. In from McGlinchey. Cleared by German. Donachy. Corona goes long and over the top, and it's a well-weighted pass. Here's Petrados. Petrados, square ball. That's Simon, he knows he's in for a pretty tough one-on-one -on -one contest. Jay North as McLaren skips away down the left. And that is death. McLaren's layoff picks out Petrados, who goes looking for Enrique, but he's well watched by German. Nothing German, certainly expect Abbas to go forward in that situation. Again, a good pass from German. One player to talk about because you know, maybe a few people are surprised when Kenny Lowe signed Mark Warren, but he's been one of their best performers this season. Shandor. Sydney happy to sit in and try and play on the counter. Ten men of Sydney FC. Set to equal their biggest win of the season. They thumped the Mariners 4-1, you might remember, at this venue. And they've got a three-goal cushion now over Perth Glory. <laughs> Yemen. Allowed rather Reds to get back and regain shape. Gee. Very much uh, the golden boy of Chinese football for over a decade. 92 caps for his country. Matt Yerman. Off by Stamboltsev. Couldn't get the return though off Ryan Grant. Good win back by Yerman. Through. Still ostensibly in pre season. They begin their domestic campaign against Chongqing Li Fan at the weekend. Seb Ryle and the scatter smelts in there as well. Oh, and off the woodwork from O'Neill. Oh, Ryan Grant couldn't bring it under his spell quick enough. Otherwise, Sydney were away again. It still might be. Yerman. Dropping short. Yerman. Carney taking up a goal. It's up in the deep by Lee Sui Peng and a good burst forward by the left fullback. Who can he find the cross? It's not bad. Not done away by Yerman. Guangzhou for their part, preparing another change themselves in a moment. Yerman. A lot of pace. In Mu Chang Jin, like you say, these South Korean sides they do like to play and use the width. 
another key player, Kang Seng. Heading back to Australia initially with the Central Coast Mariners, now with Sydney FC. The Steel Yard, match day two. That's why they lead Group H as things stand. No foul on Vesemelis from Zach Anderson. And there's a bit of space here on the right from Moon Chang Jin. Quickly closed down by Hall. Must be said. Just to find the space for. Good climb in the air by Yerman. Two wing backs. It's the midfielder Park John. He's done well there. Tend to get out and get it back to O'Neill. Forward by Yerman. Really. And instead it's Pohang on the attack down the right through Kang Sang Wu. Two in the box to try and pick out. Yeah, in the way. Making his debut for Pohang tonight. Yeah, well, Cho Ho Ju for once he had someone with him. Yerman. Good feet to get clear of Lee J. Watt. Kim Won Eel to hit it into the channel for Cho Ho Ju, but.